Another day, another vlog. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Laura. If you're new here, hi, welcome. Nice to have you here. It's really cool that you found my channel. So in today's video, I am gonna have some family time. I'm gonna go to the Fridays for Future strike demonstration. What's the English word? I think demonstration, right? Yeah. No, I don't know why I'm in such a good mood and it, it doesn't really make sense. Maybe because it's Friday and it means it's almost the weekend. No, I don't know. This is annoying. This is really annoying. Or is that my antidepressants kicking in? Yeah, I think that that's probably it. My antidepressants are kicking in. I'm currently getting ready for work. Uh, I'm packing my bag. I have prepped some overnight oats um, that I'm taking with me they're not really pretty though I mean look I can show you like it's like apples and then it's like chia seeds and then vanilla and sugar protein powder and then oats um, obviously and I think Oh, and some vegan yogurt be basically the same as on my youtube channel if you're interested because I basically always eat the same thing um, at work because I like it so much nothing new maybe I'm boring who knows no I probably am I'm gonna pack my hydro flask because we need to hydrate it also has the USC logo because I used to go to USC when I was living in LA So we've been to the protests and it was really cold but there were a bunch of people and we walked for quite a bit and right after I went to the gym and you don't believe what happened my gym crush talked to me he literally talked to me but it wasn't like flirty or anything but that still counts right at least he noticed me and I was contemplating starting a conversation with him then I was like, uh, you know what, no. <laughs> yeah, so that's that. New day, same hairstyle because I'm boring. Also, I just remembered that I was telling you guys about my presentation in my last video, but I've never told you how it went. And it went really well. <laughs> if you thought I'm gonna tell you like a huge story about how this, this presentation went, uh, you're wrong.
before I go to the gym, I have to return this ASOS package. I was ordering like a nice pair of pants that I was eyeing for I think two months and then it was on sale and it just didn't fit. It looked so horrible so I have to give it back. to death to be honest I, yeah, I'm really hungry look what I found like cinnamon toast crunch bars I mean in Germany they're called cinnaminis but these are like um, bars and I don't know they just look so yummy I'm so excited to try these The most random post-workout breakfast, like I'm eating this bread roll and I will eat it with hummus and peanut butter and then I also have this yogurt mixed with um, protein powder, it's like vegan churro flavored protein powder so it's basically just cinnamony. Yeah so I, I like having like something savory and something more sweet after. And I think I'm also going to eat a um, protein bar um, as a dessert <laughs> after, after breakfast. <laughs> but uh, I have a sweet tooth. What can I say? What can I say? I showered, I cleaned up the apartment and now I'm getting ready. My dad is the most unpunctual person on planet Earth. So he wanted to be here at like 2 and I know him and I was like he's not gonna be here at 2 and I just got a message telling me that they're 20 minutes late so I have a little bit more time which is nice and today I'm not gonna go for like a full makeup or anything just keep it simple keep it natural I'm just gonna put on some concealer do my eyebrows a little bit and a little bit of blush and a little bit of lipstick and I think that's pretty much what I'm gonna do. So I'm mixing two different concealers because this is one, this one is a tad too light and this one is a teeny tiny tad too dark and when I mix them they're perfect. I've never really felt myself doing my makeup. It's very, very new to me. I let my concealer sit a little bit. I feel like it, it just has more coverage if you do so. Um, so next up I just take this um, eyebrow pencil and fill in the gaps in my eyebrows and now I do it usually with my pinky yeah I mean I have like some red spots left from the ac acne that I was struggling with last year um, but I learned to embrace my imperfections. Yeah, I never really had issues with my skin really and last year a couple of 
bad things happen and I felt like really I just wasn't doing my best that really took a toll on me and I started getting acne my outside was reflecting how I felt on the inside and that really took a toll on my self-esteem and I just learned to embrace my natural face as it is before I had acne I never left the house um, without makeup and that has changed ever since so um, now I really prefer um, wearing no makeup or just very very light makeup and that's something that I've learned you know during that time to just embrace my face with its, its flaws and imperfections and that just me like in the end I just got out of, out of that situation way stronger than I've been before morning or actually it's noon almost it's like 11 30 <laughs> but even though i've been awake for like quite a while now i just prefer to stay in bed because it's sunday and i just wanted to have like a chill morning um before the new work week starts tomorrow yesterday the day with my sister was just so nice i really enjoyed uh, spending quality time with her and my dad i felt like my sister and i were able to bond a little bit um i mean she's so small like she's seven and she really looks up to me and that's so cute and i love her so much like yeah she's the cutest on today's agenda is making breakfast because yesterday we went to the theater and we ate a lot of like sweets i'm not feeling bad about it uh, in terms of like calories and anything i really have a healthy relationship with food but i can notice that my body is telling me i need something nourishing vitamins <laughs> minerals <laughs> yeah that's how yeah, that's what it feels like right now um I'm also way more thirsty than I usually am. I think that's because of that. But yeah, that's what my body needs right now. Um, I'm not the one to compensate. I don't do that. I haven't moved really. It's almost 11.30. We're not compensating because that's not a thing. We just enjoy ourselves and we listen to our body and we listen to our cravings and that's what we're gonna do. on a walk right now because I'm tired and I thought maybe some fresh air fresh air will help uh, but it doesn't it's like really cold and I mean look at me I'm wearing I always look the same when I go outside because I'm always wearing my warmest jacket 
and the same beanie because I don't like my other beanies and okay this is awkward and the thing is I wish I was a fashion girly like wearing all those cute wearing all those cute outfits but then I realize it's cold and then I'm like you know what fuck it I'm just gonna wear something warm and comfy and that's like it's like that every day or for work for lab I'm like oh yeah maybe I should have like a cute hairstyle do my makeup wear a nice outfit and then I wake up and I'm really freaking tired and then I'm like you know what I'm not gonna do it is anyone else like that like I honestly I mean I have my Pinterest girl moments or my that girl moments I really do but not when it's cold or when I'm tired <laughs> that, that's that <laughs> is anyone else like that or am I the only one maybe you can just comment down below what you think or how that is for you If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and to leave a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one.